Here is lesson 24 for snare. We will play numbers 57 and 58. You should have already looked through them. You should have already noticed that we have a pickup note. Now, what is a pickup note? A pickup note is a note that comes before the first full measure, as it says in the definition, but it also does not count as a measure. So if you look at 57, you see one quarter note by itself in that first measure. Okay, That is not a measure. So when we say measure one, we're talking about that first measure that has a quarter note, <coughs> two eighth notes, and then two more quarter notes. That's measure one. So when you count measures in music, make sure you don't count the first beat as a measure because it's an incomplete measure, so it doesn't count as a measure. All right, here we go. Number 57. Keep in mind, when you're playing, thumb, finger, that's the grip point. Everything else wraps around and holds that stick steady. Okay, here we go. One, two, I'm sorry, I want to give you one, two, three, we play on beat four. Here we go, one, two, three. Now I want you to go back and review. Watch the video. I I sticked two different ways. The first two measures I did right, left, right, left, right. And I did that for two measures. I also did that in the last two measures. That is alternating your sticking every single note. Okay? Another way, what we learned earlier, was for the right hand to start an eighth note. So that first measure is right, right, left, right, left, right right, left, right. So you have two rights in a row. Both of those ways are correct. As you notice, I played the music correctly and nothing faltered, nothing failed. I didn't lose my technique, didn't lose my volume, didn't lose my precision and my strike. So just remember, do whatever works, but be able to do different sticking because sometimes the music will require you to do something different than you're used to. All right, you should have also gotten your one measure repeat signs. That you will see fairly frequently in music. Snares and basses will see it a lot more often than any other musician in the band. Alright, before we get to number 58, let me tell you about our code word. Our code word is staff. Okay, you read music on the staff. Okay. Alright, here we go. Number 58. I want to review something before we play it. When you have your buzz roll, your hand is not gripped all the way around the drumstick for the buzz roll. Uh, sorry, for the multiple bounce stroke. It's open a little bit. So if it's closed, I'll have... And if I let it open... Now notice, did I do that? No. Hear how uncontrolled that is? Now, if I just release a little bit, that's a lot more controlled. So this is what I'm doing with my fingers as I play. See that subtle difference? That's what we're doing. Okay, so make sure you don't open your fingers more than that. All right, here we go. 58, Erie Canal and Capers. And one, two, three. Now again, did you notice I did two different stickings? Sometimes I just alternated, sometimes I hit again with the eighth note. Like for instance, uh, I forget which measure it was. I think it was the second measure on the second line. I did, no, that wasn't it. 
I don't remember where it is, but I remember that I do alternate. So make sure you can do more than one type of sticking. All right, that was lesson 24. Thanks for joining me.